Hey guys, it's Lee. Welcome back to my channel and to this What I've Warmed Wednesday video. So this does look a huge amount. <clears throat> it's really not. It's just because obviously I've had the Scentsy Bricks that um, I also have, <coughs> excuse me, I also have the bars. So where I do have the bars, I've warmed the bars, but I've still popped the brick in the basket. So um, without further ado, let's crack on. So first up, as I just flashed, is Beach Daisy. So this is described as honeydew melon, wild daisies and green apple make a bouquet of fresh picked paradise. So yeah, have the brick, also had the bar, so warmed the bar because obviously the brick will take far longer to get through than the bar. So just to save space, I thought, well, I'll use the bar at first. So sniffing the brick and the bar, they do smell exactly the same. So yeah, I do really like Beach Daisy. I've liked it since I've had it back in 2021 which is when this bar is from. It's a nice, slightly fruity floral. Um, it, it's quite creamy as well. Um, well, I find it a bit of a creamy scent. So that is a really nice one. At the end, I will kind of go through and give you my personal rankings. Um, next up, is cucumber and cactus water. So this is crisp cucumber wades into refreshing cactus water and sea salt. And again, I think, I'm sure that the bar and the brick do actually smell exactly the same. Yeah, pretty much. So I do only have two cubes of this left. So yeah, do really like this one. It's quite a fresh scent. I've had this in the bedroom and it's quite nice in the bedroom as is Beach Daisy. Then <coughs> next up is Orchard by the Sea which is described as an apple orchard flourishes beneath sea salt skies with whispers of crisp linens and green mango. Now this one <coughs> I had in the bathroom. It's a really nice all round scent. I did really enjoy warming this. It's on the fresh side I would say. Which is why I decided to try it in the bathroom and I did really like that. Then comes Summer Berry Melon which is described as cassava melon, strawberry, raspberry and pineapple burst on the scene in a fruity and fun sensation. And this one for me was really surprising. Um, what I found is this one and pink apple and nectarine which I'll come on to in a minute definitely much stronger on warm. Um, on my first cold sniffs I didn't really get a huge amount from it but on warm they are definitely more um, of a performer than cold. Did really like this one. I actually accidentally left my warmer on in here last night and that's what's warming in my child warmer which you can't see and when I walked in here this morning it pretty much slapped me across the face. Um, really really surprised by the performance of that one. Then the last of the bricks is pink apple and nectarine which is described as pink apple and golden nectarine dance in a field of wild poppies and lush sugar cane. Now I did think that this was very light on cold. I still think it's very light on cold. But it really does transform when it's warm. I had it on top of the stairs and it's really interesting because I don't particularly get fruit or floral. Um, it's a really strange one to try and describe. I would describe it as quite a fancy scent. It reminds me almost of being on holidays in quite a fancy hotel. Um, yeah, it's really strange. I really, really like this one. Um, yeah, I really do like pink apple and nectarine. Um, 
Is it club worthy? <sighs> because I have a Brett and obviously it will take a while to get through. For me, it would be club worthy. If this came back in a bar, um, then yes, it would go into my club. But because I have to be careful with my club real estate, as much as I would like to put this in my club, I'm not going to, just because it is gonna take so long to get through the bar that, oh, the brick, that, yeah. Um, these were early release consultant kits that I did get my hands on. Um, when they are released to the general public, I would consider getting another brick. Um, then I wouldn't need to put it in my club. So <clears throat> I will go through the other two that I've warmed and then I will come back to these and give you my kind of top five ranking. So then next up is Banana Leaf and Bamboo. I'm not a fan of this one. On cold, it's definitely not as nice as warm. I did find that it's much nicer warm. So this is Juicy Sweet White Peach and Banana Leaf Envelope Aged Bamboo and Sheer Mahogany. Um, had this going in the utility room. It's quite a fresh scent, but it's not one that I would reach for often. As I said, it's I don't dislike it. I'm just not a fan. So this is going in my pile of like hurry up and use up sort of bars. Then lastly, I did another mixing of pineapple rose, which I've now finished off. So this is the sweet golden pineapple plays with zesty male lemon and a soft hint of blush rose. And yeah, wasn't keen on this one. Mixed it with custard apple, which is pineapple, sugar and mango capture the essence of custard apple. And it's it was really nice. I do like custard apple on its own as well. So I'm going to sneeze. Sorry about that. Um, it's start hay fever season. I do need to start taking my meds. So yeah, that's that finished off at last and custard apple really nice. So then back to the back to back to five bricks. So my personal kind of order, I think, would be Initially, I was going number one, number two, but I'm not quite sure now. For me, definitely these are the top two. These are definitely the top two. I'm just not quite sure which I would put over the other. Um, I would be very tempted to get another brick of each of these because I did like both of them that much. Um, I think... Possibly Orchard by the Sea just pips it to the post because of the fact that I think this would work in pretty much any room of the house. Whereas I'm not sure Pink Apple and Nectarine would work possibly like in a kitchen or bathroom. Um, it might work in a kitchen. Um, I don't know. Um, but. Orchard by the Sea and Pink Apple and Nectarine are definitely my top two. Then I think, just for sheer performance, uh, very oh, Summer Berry Melon is my third. And like I said, On Cold, it was nice. Didn't get a huge amount from it, but on Warm, certainly in the Child Element Warmer, it really packed a punch. Then <clears throat> the last two, I'm struggling to put them. Oh, see, look, they got damaged in transit again. Um, struggling with these two, which to put fourth and which to put last. I really like both of these. Um, I have warmed more Beach Daisy than Cucumber Cactus Water in the past. I think Cucumber Cactus Water, because it's more fresh than floral, again, it probably is a bit more versatile. Um, I can't, 
can't imagine warming something like beach daisy in a kitchen, whereas cucumber and cactus water would work in a kitchen. So I think this is a bit more versatile. So yes, um, I'm going to go fifth place, beach daisy, fourth place, cucumber and cactus water, third place, summer berry melon, second place, pink apple and nectarine, with the number one spot being taken by Orchard by the Sea. So that's my warm reviews and my thoughts on those. Um, as I said, I very tempted to get another brick of each of these. I may be strong and not do it. Um, <clears throat> I should be strong and not do it because I'm pretty sure if these are popular, we may see these come back um, maybe as a catalog item next year. Um, or maybe even just as a limited release. So yes, that's it for me for today. Um, that's my lunch break, or this is my lunch break, I should say. So um, yes, I will poodle off now and go and grab some lunch and um, edit this video while I eat. And then I will be off to yoga this evening, which I'm really looking forward to having had a hectic weekend. So um, yeah, join me next week for another instalment of what I've warmed. Um, there may be some more of this warmed. Um, yeah, um, I may, yeah. Definitely need to sort out, um, because as I said, my mission this month was to try and use up some re uh, retail and vendor waxes, as well as some of the older bars. So, there may not be much uh, scentsy um, warm this week. I might actually do cucumber and cactus water again to try and finish this off. But um, yes, join me next week and see what I've been warming. And until then, take care, stay safe, and I will see you next week. Bye.